Hi, I'm Jessica. And I'm Kira. And we are the Keepers of the Books, your online librarians. And we're here with a special book blog tour episode. When Penguin Random House asked us to do this blog tour, we were really honored because number one, Matthew De La Pena is a fantastic author. And Lauren Long is a great illustrator. But the book about love is amazing. This book is precious and it's rare that a book has the ability to change people's definition of something and to enhance it and to make it something so much more and this book does just that i love how he doesn't just define love the traditional way he defines love in different things around us as well as in the relationships around us as well. The pictures are amazing and they're beautiful. Very rich in color and they add to the story and the definition so much. What we did with this book was we asked some friends and some people, what is love? And they'd all have the answers I think you'd expect. And then we asked them to read this picture book together and we asked them one more time, what is love? And in every case, their definition of love expanded. And we wanna share that with you today. What is love? When someone's caring about you and showing their kindness. I think love is also caring for someone. In the beginning, there is light and two wide-eyed figures standing near the foot of your bed and the sound of their voices is love. Love is liking people a lot. Say that with me. Love is wanting the best for someone else. Love is kindness and empathy and... Forgiveness, looking for the best in others. In the beginning, there is light and two wide-eyed figures standing near the foot of your bed and the sound of their voices is love. And a train whistling blindly in the distance and each night... That's yeah, right. Train. Train. So Dean, what's love? Love is um, It's not an easy question, is it? No. Millie, what is love? In the beginning there is light and someone that is caring about you and... Is love all around us? Mm-hmm. Is it in the people we see? Mm-hmm. In the places we go? Mm-hmm. The music we hear? Mm-hmm. It's all around us, huh? Mm-hmm. I liked the love where the mom holds her child tight. <laughs> love is in all the people around us and the things we experience together um even the world we live in like the sunsets and summers and just like the little memories kind of every day we can find love right love is protecting people from scary things love is the mundane tasks of motherhood. I do it because I love you. And love is when big brother helps little sister when she is struggling to get up on the bench. Or when big brother helps little brother get a toy down from a shelf that's too high. Love is helping others do chores. Love is spending time with your family. Love is showing someone you care. Fishing. Fishing. Sharing. Going go boating with Grandpa. Going boating with Grandpa. We hope you enjoyed watching how other people's ideas of love grew. And this book will have the ability to enhance your ideas of love as well and to see it in the world around you. This book also would make a great Valentine's gift for a child of any age or even just anyone you love. I think, I think it'll definitely make a great bedtime story, and I think it'll be a great opportunity to teach your kids more about the deeper meaning of love. This is a book that you really, really should read. It is amazing, and even though it's a picture book, it's profound and powerful. And very engaging for all ages. I will definitely be sharing this one in my Valentine's story times. So be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time, happy reading. Bye!